Yeah, saw some things that just weren't working for them and wants to make some adjustments. Yeah, and no reason to wait around to do that, Greg. I mean, you might as well make those adjustments right away. Let's go quickly over to Doris Burke for an update. During that break, Coach Rivers had some words for his team. He is not happy with their perimeter defense, saying, guys, way too many open shots for them beyond the three-point line. We've got to press up closer and try to crowd them off the arc. Guys, we'll see if they got the message. Thanks again, Doris. At the line, Roka Lukic. Taking two shots. No good on that one. And he's good on the second. Gone an outstanding four or five from the field in the fourth quarter so far. Screen by Nurkic. And the ball travels out of bounds. Turnover. No clue where that pass was going. That is a brutal turnover. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. The pass to Hazania. A tad short, but it's good off the front iron. Just good, aggressive drive from him that time. Found a hole in the D and went straight to the rim. To the wing on the left. Gianovic, the pass to Toledovic. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Really good example there of some fine interior passing before that basket. Being with confidence, 50% from the field so far. Here's the screen. And he makes good on the way. Boy, they are passing the ball very crisply right now. They really are, and their last three buckets have come by way of an assist. Here's Ukic. There's Hazania. He hits it from nine. Hazania's got six points in the quarter. I love the advantage he has from a speed standpoint. Does a great job of creating separation for that shot. Let's it go from deep. Here's Toledovic. Basket made. That gives him seven field goals in 13 tries. This is a fantastic performance in this half. He didn't play as well in the first, but you know, you just know with this guy, he's always ready to turn it around. Here's Hazania. Toledovic grabs the board. Toledovic has got his eighth rebound here tonight. Portage. Shot clock at five. Screen by Nurkic. Snatched away. Here's Hazania. Pass to Ukic. Sarge with it. So here's the home team. Here's Bogdanovich. No good on the quick three. Boy, that's a surprising miss right there. He usually feasts on those wide open opportunities. They set the screen. Here's Toledovic, the 11 footer. Almost, but it rolls out. Here's Bogdanovich. Pass to Radosevich. Baseline J on the way. 
Gone six of nine on their field goal attempt since the start of the fourth quarter. Passes it to Jedic. Stolen by Sarch. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, I mean, a cold stretch offensively. They desperately need a basket. And, and guys, that's a big swing right there. I mean, taking the steal and then turning it into two easy points on the dunk. No telling how important that sequence could turn out to be. And guys, in a game this snug, moments like that are the ones we usually look back on at the end as a difference maker. And the free throw, no good. Well, 50% from the floor. The pass to Jedic. He dishes it to Nurkic. To the left side wing. Just four to shoot. He hits it from nine. Great game for him. Double double down. Ten points and eleven rebounds. Being at a 46% clip in the fourth quarter. Ukic passes to Radosovic. And Saric kicks to Bogdanovic. Dishes to Saric. Here's Radosovic. Busts the J after the KG pass thing. Gone 7 of 10 shooting the ball since the start of the fourth quarter. Pass to Jedovic. Kicks it to Toledovic. Shot clock at six. Eight for 15 with that made basket, but he's not satisfied yet. And you know what? He's shaken off the cold shooting performance from the first half. A minute 42 left in the fourth quarter. Here's Radosevic. Help the bucket. He's got 20. So it's the visitors now. It's a three-point game. Screen by Nurkic. Mordic. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. Exactly two thirds of their shots to find the bottom of the net here in the fourth, eight of 12. Feeds it to Nurkic, right wing. Six to shoot. Shoots. That's tipped. They recover it. No good from the wing. Park a big time possession here. Tell you what, their hearts have to be racing right now. I think we'll see them burn the clock a bit here. You know, I think that's probably a smart move. I think so, too. To the paint. Rebounded by Radosevic. What's your take, guys? And you know what? You've got a couple options here. You can take the three to tie it or get the quick two and then a foul. And, you know, if it opens up for them inside, the quick two would be the way I would lean, Greg. But the foul has to come immediately after. Rukic passes to Radosevic. They get it back, and they commit an intentional foul. We'll see another one of those so they can get into the penalty. You had to foul him on that occasion to stop the clock. That's the enemy in this situation. And you know what, Greg? Who knows? A few misses at the strike, and they're right there within range. You know, late game free throws are a lot different than early game free throws in terms of making them.
first free throw missing for him. We'll see if he can handle the second. And he does get the second one. And that gives them a four-point cushion. take guys and you know what and they're going to draw up something where they can get a quick shot and then maybe a foul that's got to be the game plan here i mean free throws are really their only hope points with the clock stop here's bogdanovich can't connect and so it's a victory for the road team in this one this was a hard fought well-earned victory for them greg they really had to work for this win. Yeah, that's a good point. I mean, well, weaker teams might have buckled at the end with the crowd amped up, everyone in the building kind of